Hey sis, welcome back to my channel. I know it has been a super long time since I did my last products review. I have been super busy with Moshika Beauty, which is my brand that we just launched. I am back, girl. I am back. And today we are talking about this newest product that just launched. And I'm pretty sure you guys would want to know all the deeds. So if you want to hear about of makeup by Mario and more. Make sure to keep on watching. Okay, guys, so I don't have any makeup on beside my eyebrows, so we are going to dive in. This is what I got from Sephora the other day. Let's go through. Do the eye primer kit. This one right here. Let's start with this one. So the shade that I got is actually a medium. So on there mario recommend you to mix between the two colors to get like the perfect shade for your skin and then we are going to do the cream first so on the top two is the cream i'm going to mix them and this is how like you supposed to set your eye makeup <laughs> applying I noticed that it's super easy to blend do you guys see this this is without and this is with like on un my under eye is so much lighter compared to this side right here so I really like it it doesn't feel heavy at all it doesn't feel like concealer but it actually have that coverage so I like absolutely love that part already so next we are going to put in the powder part right here you are going to buff the powder all over the eyelid area. It's like um, contour and baking, but for the eye. <laughs> That's how I feel like. But talk about the result. I absolutely love it because it's made my eyes so much brighter. And I think this would be so helpful for those people that have under eye or baggy under eye area like this is like your go-to product next product is here so i'm going in with this one right here this is his metallic eyeshadow palette i have to get the colorful one even though we're in fall right now but it's so pretty <laughs> this is my first stop trying of course i go straight to pink but okay so far it's super like smooth let's do a quick swatch beautiful like i did not even put a lot and look at the pigment it's so pigmented and it's like not like super creamy that's like annoying when you have oil oily lid at all so that's like my favorite let me part. just go in with my finger you guys and see because i feel like the finger pick up oh oh wow it does pick up so much more i think this is why i'm like into shimmer lately because I can just use my finger because you know washing makeup brushes is like pain in my <laughs> It's actually pain in my back when you wash <laughs> so many brushes But ah, oh, this is so pretty and it glide onto the, the eye set that we did earlier So much better and I'm going to apply this on the other side without the eye set or prep just so that you guys see the next different. shade i'm going in with this gold right here oh this is so fun and i'm just going to apply to the end this is so pretty you guys i can see myself using this palette every day it's not like a super gold it's like a cute pastel yellow which go really well with the pink that i pick oh it's so pretty i really love it okay guys so things that i noticed now that i did the other side off the camera is that with the prep and prom it actually gives you the true color of that eyeshadow from the palette while this one without the prep and prom when you put in the two shades it's kind of not as pretty like it's mixed together 
without like actually separating it and you don't get that true color that you want from the I palette. I feel like I'm missing something over here and with my contact lens, I think this shade right here would like look so pretty. So let's apply that. And if you think we're done, we're not done yet. So we are going in with this pearl, um, like pearl color. I don't know how to explain that, but I love to add the pearl shade to the corner of my eye because my eye is small. So I want to make it look a little bigger and bright by brightening the corner and also i know that he sell the highlighter with this collection as well but i did not buy it because on here if you read from the website it's also said that you can use as a body highlighter as well body of face highlighter in color 1578 so i think it's this one this one this one and this one so as you can see you can kind of tell it's based on like your skin tone but you can definitely use these for color for your body or your face and the last products you guys that i'm going to show you today i got this one this is the master secret glow so i think this is like the clear glow so before i use this one as my dewy highlighter i'm going to apply this it's like lip balm um, I'm going to apply this to my lid because that's like one of the recommendation if you want dewy lid <laughs> For the lid, I don't see that much of a difference. I like it without this Highlighter on it. So no for the lid didn't work for me So I'm going to finish off my makeup adding some eyeliner and some lashes to make it look better and now i'm going to apply the eyelashes that i have right here onto the eyeliner i love this eyeliner so much because i don't need to use glue anymore and it's just super easy and simple i have been like wearing eyelashes every day now since it's like don't need extra effort and it's like super long lasting like it doesn't come off with the glue i feel like i have to carry glue with me everywhere just in case like my lash come off but yeah let me go finish the other side all right so i went off the camera and finished the rest of my face as you guys can see because i want to apply this as a highlighter i did the rest of my makeup but i have not put any highlighter on here so we'll see how does this look like does it actually give you that dewy glow natural glow on the skin or not <laughs> it does give you that dewy and it's actually look um more natural than if you were to apply the highlighter so i kind of like it let me try on my nose here because so to I apply on the nose i feel like it's look even more natural on the nose I actually kind of like it but the only thing that I don't like compared to highlighter is that this one is a bit sticky and I have oily skin so it might not work for me for a long time like throughout the day like right now it looks great but for all day wear I don't know I have to try it out and then I'll let you know. Alright you guys so this is our final look right here what do you think? Let me know in the comment. So overall I really love the products I think it does worth the money I spent and my favorite one the winner of this collection is this one right here palette i was skeptical about getting this color because it's so colorful compared to the fall glam one but actually if you look more into this it's an all year long palette even though it's like colorful right but here you can wear it summer and spring and these shades are perfect for fall and winter even so if you are looking for colorful palette that are perfect for all year long definitely check out this one and especially it has shimmer and creamy texture that are super light so it's a great product for everyone. And that's it for today, you guys. I hope you guys love the review. If you have bought it already, feel free to share your opinions in the comment. And if you have not bought it, which products are the one that you 
thing you would buy from this collection let me know in the comment as well thank you so much for watching today i hope you guys enjoy it and if you have not subscribed to my youtube channel make sure to subscribe down below and hit that bell button so that when i post next time you won't miss it also if you have not followed me on instagram check it out right here and i'll see you guys there bye